Mr. Chairman, 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 Mr
And I really do uh, appreciate the engagement here because I think we have a wonderful story to tell. Let me, let me just start with the whole notion of the philosophy around nuclear. When I talk about safe, clean, reliable, affordable energy that drives this nation's economy and serves the benefit of our customers, nuclear, in my view, is a dominant solution for the future. The United States runs a premier nuclear power um, business. When we think about our posture with respect to safety, that is paramount. We get up in the morning thinking about safety, we go to bed at night thinking about safety. You just wouldn't believe how pervasive that is as a foundational principle in how we run our business. And so we are absolutely committed to a safe operation of a nuclear fleet. And if you look at our performance, we absolutely meet the standards that our customers expect and, frankly, deserve. So let me start there. Now let's go to Fukushima and our decision to move forward with Plant Vogel. Fukushima was a tragic event. The United States nuclear power industry offered assistance. We have learned everything we can learn about the unfortunate circumstances <clears throat> that occurred there. And we are applying those learnings here as we apply learnings from anywhere that we think we can improve our own performance. That is a characteristic of the nuclear industry in the United States. And so not only are we applying the learnings now, we'll apply them next year and whatever learnings we have in the decades ahead to making the United States nuclear industry the best in the world. When I think about, you know, you kept using big bets and then bet the farm. Very interesting kind of comment. Bet the farm. When I think about the kind of companies that should move forward with new nuclear, I've always kind of mentioned them having three characteristics, which really go to the heart of your question. Number one, when you consider Plant Vogel 3 and 4, it's a $14 billion deal, 10 years to build. We own 45.7% of it. It is a big investment. So, you've got to have scale. Southern Company is the largest electric utility in America. The investment at Georgia Power is $6.1 billion. Our market cap is around $40 billion. So, we have the scale necessary to go forward. Secondly, you've got to have the highest level of financial integrity. That's why I spent some time, frankly, talking about risk and how important that is. Remember, as investors, value is a function of risk and return. Risk is as important as return in determining value. This other company has the highest level of financial integrity of any company of size in our industry. And so that's important. Because we know when you undertake a 10-year kind of construction program, you can never take a day off. You must be committed, and in fact, we are. And in fact, I can tell you this, that the farm, Wall Street believes that we're going to be successful. Our stock has performed beautifully. Our ratings remain high. We just underwent ratings reviews by Standard Boards and Moody's and um, uh, Fitch. And uh, we're evaluated being one of the best uh, utilities in America from a financial integrity standpoint. So that's great. If you just look at the data, the market that's with us as well, forget what the rating agencies say. This year, Georgia Power has issued a billion and a half of debt securities, having an average life of about 25 years and an interest rate of about 3.9%. I think that is extraordinary and reflects the market's confidence in our ability to execute. The third point, the third characteristic of companies that should pursue nuclear are those which already have credibility of operation. This is no business for beginners. We run one of the best nuclear programs in the United States. Let's go to, to the technology that we're talking about and why Plant Vogel, I think, makes sense. Recall, as apart from Fukushima, Plant Vogel is not on a coastline. It's some 130 miles inland, 220 feet above sea level. It is not in a seismic sensitive area. And the technology that we're employing, the Westinghouse AP1000, is the newest safest technology on the planet. In fact, the design of the AP-1000 would have obviated 
a lot of the problems that occurred at Fukushima. Now, we don't rest on our laurels. We work diligently every day to execute that project. And what I'm able to say is that we are, all targets are achievable with respect to schedule and ultimately cost to customers. One of the things I'm proud to say is since certification, we have generated, we believe, potentially up to $2 billion of incremental value for Georgia's customers. We're very confident in our ability to execute. Thanks very much for that. Next